On the 1st of January 1900, Queen Victoria wrote in her journal, I begin today a new year and a new century, full of anxiety and fear of what may be before us. She was right to be fearful. There was a war on. In South Africa, the Boers and the British were fighting each other. And at home, while Britain's rulers consoled themselves that most workers still knew their place, there were troubling signs of political and social unrest. The war, though, was the main preoccupation. My first memories of 1900 were that the South African War was started, and the great topic of all the time there in Aberdeen was the war, the war. Several men had volunteered and gone, and we as youngsters used to be plain soldiers all the time. What I can remember vividly about uh, things along then is the fact that great victories in South Africa meant a half holiday for us. We used to go around the village in the afternoon, I remember, singing songs and waving flags, patriotic songs, and here and there, of course, you'd see a, a Union Jack or something of that sort poked out of a window and so on. That's the way the village people expressed their loyalty. Of course, all through the war, the, the news used to come through every day and was in the form of bulletins. It used to be posted outside the post office. Newspapers were nothing like as common as they are now. Only a person here and there took the newspaper. And these bulletins used to be uh, posted outside the post office and if there was anything big happening just then, there'd be quite a little crowd all day long looking at them.